Remington Tame the Mane Electric Detangling Brush, and it's supposed to do all of the detangling for me. These little bristle things move back and forth, and they're supposed to detangle quickly and painlessly. The box is that you can use this on wet or dry hair, so I figured we'd split the hair down the middle and do one side wet and the other side dry. I'm gonna be testing this detangler out on how well it detangles, how quickly it detangles, and how painlessly it detangles. I'm not really sure about the last one because this is terrifying. All I have in my hair right now is my normal detangling spray that I use every single time I detangle. So what they want you to do is kind of like work bottom up. So like do it little by little, raise it, do it little by little, raise it until you get to the top. And you know, you keep doing it until it's all detangled. Oh. Oh, actually it's literally not as terrifying as I thought at all. I have to say that so far, even though I did hit one or two snags because I didn't remove the brush and then start at the top again, that was my own fault. This thing is working pretty painlessly. Like I don't feel anything when it's going through my hair and I expected the dry side to be literally so painful. One thing that I can say is that with my normal detangling brush in the shower, I feel like I shed a lot more. This is like, no big deal. This is nothing compared to like what's left over in the shower when I'm done brushing my hair. Okay, so now we're gonna do the wet side. I'm just gonna spray my hair with my spray bottle. I don't want it to be soaking, soaking wet, but thoroughly damp. I'm already noticing a huge difference in detangling the wet side versus the dry side. It's just gliding through the hair so much easier. Obviously, I just think wet hair in general is easier to detangle, but I'm liking it a lot better on the wet side. I also think it's moving so much faster through my wet hair, so I do think that it's possible that this detangles faster than my normal way of detangling, but only if your hair is actually wet. Before I tell you guys what I think about the detangler, I'm gonna have my friend Celia and AC also try it out so we can see how it performs on different hair types. I have like straight hair, like this is pretty much it, like after it dries after the shower, but it's incredibly fine. So I'll brush it fully out and then take a step and it'll be completely tangled again. So my natural hair is like what I think is 4C hair. So very thick, classic Afro black hair. It feels really like skinny. Like I feel like it feels like, I mean my hair is very thin, but like I feel like it feels less th like thick. Like it just feels very smooth. I feel like a lot, since my hair is so fine, it kind of like slipped through a lot of places. But other than that, I mean, I think it's like, it feels like pretty untangled. Like when I finger comb it, like I don't really snag. I'm surprised that this is even kind of working. It hits a snag, but it's not, it doesn't feel like it's like pulling at my hair. So I'm yeah. fine, like it doesn't, I could see like a kid maybe being like, ow, it hurts, just that any like feeling of like a pull, but like as an adult man, <laughs> it's just fine. One thing I'm noticing is that it's just really easy for parts of the hair to like completely go through because the bristles are so wide. So it just might not even get touched when you pass through it. Is it still like not painful? No, it's not painful. But I feel like it's hard because for some reason this isn't feeling as like smooth to me. I'm shocked because I, like, I did not think this was gonna work at all, wet or dry. <laughs> so. I literally was expecting it to be like. <laughs> so I thought I was expecting it to be spinning and then to be like. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, so it just encountered a pretty thick clump. 
and I just slowed down and went through it a few times and then it just went straight through. So on the first side, the dry side, definitely took a long, long time, much longer than usual. On the wet side, much quicker. Taking AC and Celia's experiences into consideration, I think that I can say that this product does work and it does work for different hair types depending on how you use it. I don't think that this is gonna replace my normal method of detangling because I do like to do it in the shower and this thing has batteries in it, but it's a product that does what it says it's gonna do.